All right, guys, how's it going? It is Friday, the 17th of November, 2017, and you're watching CapTalk.tv. Red. I nearly said fucking January. I wish it was fucking January. Don't wish your life away to say, I can't be done with all that bollocks on TV, guys, to do with Christmas. I can't. I'm a right miserable git when it comes to that. Makes me think of people that aren't here anymore, do you know what I mean? Fuck that shit. I, I don't like it. It's all right if you've got kids and that, you know, but fucking there, fuck. Can't get my chair to fucking move, it's stuck in, what is it? It grooves in my tiles. I know what you're thinking, you're thinking, no, it's because you're a fat, no, it ain't, no, it ain't, stuck in, fuck, look. All right. Hey, have you checked out this movie yet? This film, Kenny? Yeah, have you seen the trailer for it yet? I'll put the link in the video description below, right? Have an Aussie, if you haven't, if you haven't heard about it, where, where the fuck have you been? Um, I got invited to uh, to a private screening of it this week, you know, for the, the ahead of the release, and um, I couldn't go. Do you know, I'm overseas, aren't I? You know, and um, I did. If I'd have had more notice, I'd have gone. But um, you know, I said to those involved, I said it's very kind of you to invite me to this, um, but I can't come. Simple as that. And um, you know, so anyway, basically, I arranged for someone else to go on my behalf. Um, so it was, um, yeah, anyway, so I just wondered if you'd heard about it. It does look very promising. Now, I was just looking at the, um, the, the, the poster. It says here, UK cinema release date, 17th of November, which is today. Um, so I'm not sure what the, you know, where it's, you know, if, if it be nationwide or whatever, if it's in your area, or if you go and see it, let me know. I've got, um, a copy of it coming over to me, like, you know, so, um, but yeah, you know, I'll 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 do a vid after I've watched it, no doubt. I mean, um, I love stuff like that, and not just about Liverpool Football Club guys. I you know I would watch that about any major you know player or whatever, and you know I just love stuff like that, the real stuff. And I think what will be good about this is it, I think it's going to be um, you know about him as well, not just like oh what a great player he was, but about him, what makes him tick and stuff. It says there, featuring Kenny Dalglish, Alan Hansen, John Barnes, Ian Rush, Sir Alex Ferguson even. Uh, but yeah, so let me know if you, you know, when you see it, basically. So this video will be up for, up for a while. Well, it'll be up for fucking ever, no doubt. Um, I do turn the comments off on my videos after a while because the notification, when you start getting like an email on a video from three years ago, I'm like, what the fuck? I don't even know what it means, you know. So, um, but do, if you go and see it, let me know what you think. Yeah, I mean, I spoke to people that have seen it and told me it's brilliant. So, uh, but unfortunately, I haven't seen it yet. And it's stuff like that I like going to. It's like one of the perks of the uh, of the job, if you can call it that. Do you remember me and Rob went to um, the premiere in Liverpool of Will? Do you remember that? W-I, was it W-I-W-L? Will? Will? Yeah, that was it, Will. How else would you spell fucking Will? What am I, what am I thinking? Um, but yeah, we went to that and uh, actually we, um, we sat with the king and all that. You know, not like sat fucking right next to him. Um, but yeah, the, I, there is a video on here on, on coptalk.tv. If you go to coptalk.tv and then it, where it lists all the videos and you can search in videos, just put Will in. I mean, it's a, it's a few years ago now. You know, it was only, we only recorded it on a little fucking poxy phone or something at the time. Because it was quite a while back. Rob was only a young lad in it and it was more so for him to because he you know he interviewed some of the like the, the the actors and stuff like that we were on the uh, you know next to the red carpet inside and then uh, we got to the you know VIP screening and that and all, all the all the, the the legends were there and that's just amazing really in fact there's a picture of our Rob with uh, Roy Evans at that and again some of you will remember that and um, when we we met up with Roy Evans last year was it last year or this year guys I reckon it was last year. Uh, in Spain at some gig, and um, I showed Roy Evans that. I was like, "Here, yeah, so look at this. There's a there's a different there's a picture. If I can find it, I'll put it on this video on the screen. Uh, but yeah, I'm not gonna fuck around too much. But I'll I'll see if I can find them. If not, then I couldn't be asked. All right. But I says to Roy, I said, "Look at that difference in that. You know, between like the lad he is today, Rob, compared to back then, because Rob was probably about eleven, and." Um, He's 18 now. My son's 18 now. Can you believe it? It was his 18th birthday the other day. Unbelievable. I bought him um, 
an Xbox X, Microsoft Xbox X, is that it? The new one? Not the S, the X. And um, obviously I had to buy him a fucking, what is it? I bought him a 4K TV, 50 inch TV for his bedroom. He, he, he lives with his mum, you see. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, but that's my, my point, man. You know, I'm like, fuck's sake, you know. I'm sat here fucking, you know, struggling and that, begging you lot to join DKB.TV and the members website. Fucking hell, getting the plastic out for Rob, you know what I mean? Yeah, son. But he's my son, isn't he? You know, as your kids, you know yourself. Hey, I've got a message, guys. I've got a message. Let's have a look. <clears throat> oh, oh, oh. It says, content's hidden. Oh, some shitty message from Facebook. Fucking hate that shit, man. Um... I mean, when you got kids and that, you 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 just put the I don't know. Maybe I, I'm I don't know. My mum was like that. She had like three, four, four jobs. I think when I was a little nipper, you know, make she made sure I had every fucking thing. You know, she was a single parent, and she made sure I had everything. And you know, I'm, I've sort of like got the same thing with my kids. You know, as, so some people are the opposite because I know you're probably thinking, well, no, we're, we're all the same thing. And I hope you are. But some people are the opposite, and they go, no, 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 I want them to understand that they have to work for things. They say, fuck off, miserable cunts. Fuck's sake, man. Yeah, my lad's 18 now, so I reckon that's his last big, like, present, you know what I'm saying? I don't fucking know, I don't know. We get out for fucking Christmas. The fucking money that that costs, I tell you. Anyway, we went to Will and we enjoyed it. We had a good, hey, where's the fucking screen going? Even computers bored of me. Um, no, we had a good time at that. And now I would love to have gone. And um, it's nice to get invitations to stuff like that, you know, uh, before it's released, especially. And you get to meet a few folk and that. But no, nah, I couldn't fly in. I couldn't justify that. Like, and I know a lot of you are thinking, you, are, you couldn't just, yeah, but when you've done it, guys, you've fucking done it, you know what I'm saying? So a few years ago I guess I would have been all, all over it but now I was just like you know fuck that my slippers you know I've got my slippers on now it's true I'm an old man now I'm a granddad I'm a bloody granddad now hmm yeah well there you go so anyway that's it I just wanted to see if you've seen it yet I don't guess maybe you haven't you know but maybe your DVD or whatever's dropped through the door there's a link in the video description below to the article about it which I did a week ago or something I think I ain't even fucking, I know there's one but I haven't even found it yet um, but there's a link in there where you can where you can buy it and um, well, I'm not interested whether you, you know I mean buy it wherever you want I'm just telling you um, but there is a there is a trailer on there and it's um, it's good or you can, or I'll just look on here straight away so uh, yeah so let me know what you th what you think of it um, I look forward to to seeing it myself. I'm I'm, I'm pissed that I couldn't go to it, to be honest. Uh, but there you go. But um, you know, I, I actually I, I sent someone on my on my behalf that um, you know it's difficult when you get stuff because it's like I could invite for, you know I could send loads of people, can I? You know, uh, but I sent some you know I, well I, I made the offer to someone you know initially that I know. Uh, that's been a good contributor to Cop Talk over the years and uh, has always had my back and uh, you know he, he, he had um, a, um, a bereavement a very close bereavement in his family recently we're talking within the last few weeks and um, straight away I was like yeah you know I've got to offer it to him because uh, maybe that'll you know pick him up a little bit do you know what I mean so um, there you go. So, um, mm, so I can't go. I can't go. Never mind. But I, I will uh, no doubt watch it within the next week or so, something like that. Right, guys. Uh, let me know if you see it. Yada yada yada. And is there any other like you know like football like films, documentaries, programs that you like? Tell you what, I watched on um, I watched on Netflix recently. And that was one about uh, Ibrahimovic. It might have been called being I Im, Im, might have been called being Ibrahimovic. I can't remember. Uh, and it had old footage of him, you know, like when he was a young lad, and his attitude and his because I like him. You know, he's one of these people that are classed as a legend. I just like some of his arrogant quotes and that. Whereas Cristiano Ronaldo, for example, is an arrogant cunt, but I don't like him. I just don't like him. It's nothing to do with the fact he played for Manchester United. He just doesn't seem like one of them players that it's more about him than the team. 
you know. So anyway, I liked that. I watched it on uh, Netflix. It wasn't. It, I don't know. It was very. It was just good because it was like uh, you know old footage and behind the scenes stuff. I recommend it if you're a football fan. You're probably like, oh, see that fucking scum cunt. You know, and uh, I also saying on the team uh, the same topic of Manchester United. I really enjoyed that BBC series uh, documentary. What was it called? I can't remember. But um, you know, it was uh, Neville, uh, the Neville's one of its schools gigs to do with them and that uh, that football team. Southend, what is it? Southend, season? maybe it was just fucking called that. I can't remember. Uh, fantastic, uh, loved it. Absolutely loved it. Uh, the Cluffy film, yeah, that, that film about, uh, oh God, it's, it's down there, I've got it just over there, I can't remember what it's called, you know, I'm on the spot, really enjoyed that. Um, there was Goal, wasn't there, Goal movie, do you remember that, by Mike Jeffries, uh, that tried to buy Liverpool Football Club, he, he invited me to that. Uh, but, uh, you know, I, really, I actually really liked that film, ended up being Newcastle United, but he tried to get Liverpool, but... Rick Parry weren't having any of it at the time, you know, so that was that. That was a guy enjoyed Goal. I thought Goal was a great movie. Uh, when Saturday, was it one called When Saturday Comes? I can't remember. The stacks of them, isn't there, guys? Let me know what your favourite, uh, you know, football documentaries are, movies, anything like that. Because you know, I, I like to keep an eye on stuff that I might have missed, like, you know, so. Anyway, that's Kenny. Uh, we'll watch Kenny. I can't tell you if it's any good yet because I like to form my own opinions. Uh, but I'm sure it is. I'm sure it's very special. And, um, yeah, I'd like to know your thoughts on it when you get to see it. All right, guys. I'm waffling on again as usual. I'll speak to you in a bit. I hope. All right.